eye infection. I have this real problem where I keep taking my glasses off to go do something and not bringing my glasses with me and then I can't find them anywhere. Of course, concealed on a bag of junk food. I just napped for a little bit too long and now it's time to go grab Jamie from the airport. I think that I'm in departures on account of it was an accident. That's what I need. There she is. said to myself, Sam, today seems like a good day to wear contacts. Let's do this. Oh my god, this is like a delight. Oh my god, wow, wearing contacts is a delight. I forgot how wonderful this is. Is it the best? It really is. <laughs> I put Sam's glasses on for all of 20 seconds and then I threw up. <laughs> the world was a blur. Did it? Did? We're going to Disneyland. <laughs> there comes a time in every person's life where they say to themselves, I'm an adult, and yet, I wanna go to Disneyland. Disneyland! Also, you will note that the eye infection era is officially over. <laughs> For a second, the tickets didn't have any characters on them, and I was like, I'm leaving. But they do, it's fine. I saw a balloon on the ground, and out of anger and frustration, because Disneyland is so different here, I kicked it, and then Jamie kicked it into <laughs> my face. <laughs> Oh yeah, they're so embarrassed. Yeah. Bashful. We got us some nutrients to last us through the day. We're going on the Hollywood Tower of Terror and we will compare it to the one in LA. So far it's the same. Props are adequately similar. I think I'd say that one was funner than LA. It had more drops. It was fun. I was gonna try and film in there but then I chickened out. That looks just the same. I don't know about you, but this just gives me some serious throwback vibes. This connect, mm, so good. We're back from Disneyland. We're gonna go get soup and egg rolls. Cause that's what we feeling. Our Uber driver just showed us this uh, drawing book he has and he drew all these himself. It's really cool. Uh, my favorite is that Amber. one. That's so cool. We just woke up. Today I have a meeting with Nyx, but first we're gonna go get uh, free breakfast. How's it treating you, Jamie? 
see, you're happy to be out of bed now. So this is the outfit for today. You know, business chic with a little bit of cleavage. What are you doing today, Jamie? I'm staying here when you go to work. <laughs> I'm the fence to grab away. I just got back from my little meeting with Nyx. Um, unfortunately, we weren't allowed to film at all inside the building, um, but now I think we're going to wait a little bit. Stop cleaning our room. They live to clean their rooms. Um, but now I think we're going to wait a little bit and then gather up the troops and go see the catacombs of Paris. We're all ready to go spelunking, except for Karen. No, this is like, it's a cute little outfit with OOTs, right? <laughs> <laughs> that sounds like not ready to me. Yeah. We're heading to the catacombs, but apparently it gets super, super busy, so we're hoping that we can get in, and if we don't, I will be devastated. We're here. Is that a ghost up ahead? <sighs> Jamie? You guys, this is a little bit too... Like Jamie just barely fits in this place. It's almost as if it was designed for her. No. So Jamie was just asking me why this is here and why this happened. So basically, there was all these cemeteries that were like overflowing with bodies, um, and. They had nowhere to put them, they had nowhere to bury them anymore. Just too many bodies. Too many, like, yeah. Like, too many. So they, um, a couple people said to, like the police and some other inspectors were like, let's start putting them underground in these tunnels that they had all through the, under the underneath the city anyways. And that's what they started doing. Like, are those just, are they just sitting? 1787 these bodies were here, that's crazy. 1793, October. Look at, there's like drips all over the ceiling. So that was that. Do you think that it's on purpose that none of the skulls had their teeth? Um, I don't know, but I do know um, in World War II when they would like um, send Jewish people into the gas chambers and stuff, if they had gold teeth, they would go in after gold. and take out all their gold teeth because that's how they used to fix like cavities and stuff. Yeah. They would go in and take out all their gold teeth and remelt it down and use it for like jewelry and stuff. So they'd like steal it. That's like double bad. Yeah. That was one of, if not the coolest thing I've ever done in a different city. I think that was really, really neat. So if you ever go to Paris, that's what you gotta do. Jamie? Sustenance? Yes. Jamie and I were just recapping the fact that we have known each other for five months. Five short little baby months. Is that right? Months. Uh, January, January, February, March, April, oh. May. Just barely five months. Yeah. And we have been to five countries together and eight cities in five months. How does that make you feel, Jamie? Overwhelmed. With joy. I think I need to go make some new friends. I have run out of underwear, so I'm having to buy more. Traveling woes. Yes. No. 